So Hope and I finally finished converting this camper van that we're gonna be traveling in full time and we wanted to take it up to Orlando to visit her family for Christmas. So we took the four hour drive and everything ran nice and smooth. But what we didn't realize was that there was a big cold front coming. And yes, we're in Florida, so you would never expect it to get really cold, but this cold front uh, made the temperatures drop all the way down to like 20 degrees at nighttime, which like I said, we were not expecting at all. So Hope's family insisted that we sleep in their house and we were like, no, 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 it's fine. We wanna test out our camper van. We've been working on it for a long time and we're really excited to sleep in it for the first time. So as some of you know, we installed a Propex heater. Um, it runs off of propane and we paid like a thousand dollars for this thing. So you would expect this heater to run perfect, but that's not the case. Our Propex heater stopped working around 11.30 p.m. when we needed it the most and I wasn't sure why, so I started to try to figure out why. It was displaying uh, three red dots, which is like some error code, meaning that there's something wrong with it. And we started to Google it, we started figuring stuff out. I went underneath the van because that's where it's mounted and I unplugged the wire. There's a little reset button, I clicked that. Um, and we even clicked the reset button on the uh, thermostat and it still wasn't working. So after restarting it multiple times, it actually kicked on for about five minutes and we were like, yes, we're good. Right when we started laying down in bed, it shut off again. So I was like, do we even have propane? So I checked, we have plenty of propane. So it just wasn't working and it dropped down to 29 degrees Fahrenheit in Orlando, Florida. Like what? Hope and I were freezing cold. We were cuddled underneath the blanket with clothes on, our dogs were on top of us, and we were all just trying to stay warm in this freezing ass weather. So I got my ass up again, went outside, got underneath the van, and tried to reset the heater again to see if it'll start up. And at that moment I realized, what the hell am I doing with my life? It's two o'clock in the morning, <laughs> it's 29 degrees outside, and I'm laying down on the ground underneath a van. Mind you, at this point, it's Christmas Day, but I wasn't gonna let that ruin my day. So I was like, you know what, it is what it is. I'm gonna wait till the day after Christmas to reach out to Propex and find out what's going on with this thing. So I crawled right back into bed and froze myself to sleep. Um, got up this morning and uh, it was actually a pretty good temperature inside because the sun came out. And uh, now it's Christmas Day and I'm making this video for you guys because I'm trying to share my experience with you guys of our first night in the van. The purpose of driving this van up to Orlando was to test it. And we're really glad that everything else has been running really nice. Um, we were expecting things to happen because it is a test ride. So we're glad we figured out that a heater is not working and now we can try to figure out how to fix it. But all in all, we are really happy with the way that our van turned out. We plan on moving in full time in about a month from now. And we're gonna be traveling the entire United States and possibly Canada and Mexico. So we wanna bring you guys along for the ride with us. So be sure to click that subscribe button, uh, the bell notification and all that good stuff. I really appreciate you guys for watching. I hope everybody has a Merry Christmas. See you guys in the next one. Peace.